Hey everybody, I'm back. We're gonna do some more word work. Remember, this this is so good and important to practice because it'll help you be a really good reader. So let's get started. All right, we're gonna do our rhyming. Remember, thumbs up, thumbs down. So listen really, really close. Give me a thumbs up if they rhyme, thumbs down if they don't. So here we go. So my words are snack, back. Do those ones rhyme? Snack back. I gotta give those ones a thumbs up because they do rhyme. Okay, what about tell talk? Oh, I gotta give those ones a thumbs down. Okay, what about rip ship? Those ones? Yep, gotta give them a thumbs up. Okay, what about be knee? Be knee. Got to give those a thumbs up, too. Those ones rhyme also. Okay, what about wind blow? Oh, brr, those ones are a thumbs down, huh? Wind blow. Nope, they don't rhyme. Okay, we're going to move on to our first sounds. So here we go. Many mild. Do you guys hear that? Yep, you do. You hear Missy Mouse making the letter M sound. The very first sound in that word is M. Letter M. Okay, what about upon and us? Upon and us. Yeah, you hear Umber Umbrella Bird making the letter U sound. Uh, uh, uh. Nice. Okay, what about edge effort? E edge and Effort. Yeah, there's Ellie Elephant making the letter E sound. She says eh, eh, eh. You're right. Here we go for the next ones. There it their words are save and sick. Save sick. Think about that one. You hear letter S making the s sound. Like Sammy Snake loves to make this sound, doesn't he? Okay. Alright, one more. Uh is and itchy. Did you guys hear that one? That's Amy Inchworm the, the, with the letter I. She says, I, I, I. Nice, guys. Okay, let's move on. This is where we're going to take two sounds and make one word. Okay, so here we go. Here's our sounds. Make words out of these sounds. G, O, go. Good job. What about E? Nice. Okay. What about s? Oh. So. Okay. What about wa? E. We. Okay. One more. Ba. I. Put them together. Bye. Good job. Okay. Let's move on. We're going to go to where we are going to listen to the ending sound. The and sound that you hear in this word. So we already did the ones where we hear the beginning. That is the very, very first. But this is at the very, very end. So the word is again. Again. Do you guys hear that? It is the letter N making the N. N. Okay, what about the word take? Take. Do you guys hear the very set, very ending sound? Yep, you're right. That is the k sound or the k sound, like K-O kangaroo. Okay, all right, let's move on. What about the word miss? Miss. What do you hear at the very end? You hear the s sound, don't you? Good job, letter S. Nice. Okay, what about page? Page. If you say that you hear the letter G, Gordo Gorilla making the G, 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 you're right. Okay, we'll do one more. What about the word fuzz? Did you guys hear that at the end? That is, yep, that Zeke Zebra making the Z sound of letter Z. Yeah, good job. Let's move on. You guys are doing a great job. Let's keep practicing. All right, let me, all right. So 
this is where we're gonna split a word and make sounds out of the word. So my word is my. So if we split that one up, we would say m, mm, and what would the end sound be? I, nice. Okay, what about the word say? All right, we'd split that up and say s, a. All right, what about the word do? We'd split that up and do d, u. All right, what about the word way? Split that one up. What? What was the, the ending sound? A. Nice. Okay, we'll do one more. What about the word key? We're going to do that one and split it up and say k, e, key. Nice. Okay, let's move on, guys. We are going to add a sound to another sound to make a word. So I have the sound of oo, I want to add the sound g to it. So g, oo. What would it be? Goo. <laughs> what about the word, sorry, the sound i? I want to add the sound h to it. That would make h i. What word would that be? Hi. Nice. Hi. <laughs> okay. What about the, the sound a? I want to add the sound what to it. So what a way. Nice. Good job. <coughs> Excuse me. What about the word? Sorry, the sound e. I want to add the sound b to it. B e b. Good job. Okay, one more, guys. We have the sound, the sound <laughs> of o. I want to add the sound m to it. M O Mo. Nice. You guys are getting really good at that one. So now we are going to, this is where we're going to hide a sound. So we have the word we. I want to hide the sound of what from you guys. What would you have left? E. Nice. Okay. What about the word my? I want to hide the m from you guys. Think about what the ending sound I is left, okay? All right, what about the word toe? I wanna hide the t from you. What would be what would be left? O, okay. Um, what about you? I wanna hide the y from you, from you. That would be oo. Okay, what about the word day? I wanna hide the d from you guys. And what would be left? A. Nice. Good job. You guys are doing great. Let's keep going. We're almost done. And you guys are doing a great job. So, I, uh, this is, this is kind of something a little bit new. You guys have done it. But it's really fun. Put your fists up here. You guys are getting good at this one. Okay, the word is ball. I want to get rid of the B and bring a T over so the word would be tall okay i want to to get rid of the t sound in tall and bring a f sound over so we'd have all what would that one be fall you're right you guys are listening okay what about we have the word fall i want to get rid of that f sound and bring a k sound over so the word would be all call nice okay what about i want to get rid of the k sound and bring a h sound over so it'd be h all what would that one be hall like the hallway of our school hall okay i have the word hall i want to get rid of the h sound and bring a b sound over so i would have b all Ball. Nice, guys. That one's fun. I like that. So, here we go. Um, we have a new nursery rhyme. It's called Polly Put the Kettle On, and you guys have been hearing a little bit of it this week. I'm going to add a couple of things to it. So, Polly put the kettle on. Polly put the kettle on. Polly put the kettle on, and we will have some tea. Suki, take it off again. Suki, take it off again. Suki, take it off again. They, they, 
they all gone away. It's a tongue twister. Okay, I'm going to try it again. Polly put the kettle on. Polly put the kettle on. Polly put the kettle on. And we will have some tea. Suki, take it off again. Suki, take it off again. Suki, take it off again. They all gone away. So I'm going to keep practicing that one. You guys practice it too. And we will see you soon, I hope. You guys keep up the good work. Keep practicing writing names, doing all those cool things, and your letter sounds, and keep counting. And I will see you soon. Bye.